Hi, I'm Dr. Hudson Garrett. I'm the current president for the Vascular Access Certification Board of Directors, and I'm pleased to be joined today by Lois Davis, our executive director. And we are extremely excited to have yet another upcoming session for our Vascular Access Board certification. Lois, can you tell us a little bit about what the certification covers and who it's geared towards? Sure, the certification is multidisciplinary. So any uh, clinicians working with vascular access devices, whether nurses, respiratory therapists, physicians, nutritionists, infection control practitioners, are, uh, are all qualified to take the uh, vascular access board certified exam. Right, we do offer the test twice a year. So it's offered in June and December of each year. And sometimes we have special offerings during the AVA conference each uh, year. We're extremely excited also to offer to international people that are interested in taking it. Those that actually speak English as a primary language and can follow the evidence-based practices and the content outline. So Lois, what are some of the things that you think are most exciting for vascular access professionals to really have that certification on their name tag? And I know we're doing some cool marketing with it as well. What are some of the things that they should know about the exam? before they sign up? Well, before uh, taking the exam, it's really important that anybody that's going to consider taking the exam go to our website mm -hmm. and that they download the Candidate Handbook. The Candidate Handbook explains everything that somebody needs to know about the exam, in particular, the detailed content outline. The content outline lists everything that we write items about, and that's uh, by looking at the content outline, it's a good way to determine whether you're uh, ready to take the exam. One of the things that I think is really exciting about the VABC exam itself is how different it is in the marketplace, um, specifically with the recertification. And so with this particular exam, you can recertify by exam or recertify by continuing education. And it gives you a lot of opportunities to use your skills to advance yourself professionally and also personally. Um, that recertification information is also contained in the recertification handbook um, on the website, as Lois mentioned before. We would really encourage you to think about taking the exam, share it with your colleagues, friends. If you're already Already certified congratulations um, and share that information with other colleagues our goal is to make sure that every clinician providing vascular access care across the world is certified and has their VABC it's one of the most important steps that you can take as a clinician that your facility can take to improve patient safety and that the public can see to instill confidence in the professionals taking care of them we hope that you visit our website which is www.vacert.org thank you very much